Hey gamers welcome to our channel. Today I'm going to show you the most useful tips to win more games in Splitgate. So let's jump into the video. So these tips will be separated into two different topics, the first topic is common tips and the second one is portaling tip. So let's look at some common tips that will help you to win more gunfights. When shooting always crouch spam or move, so you will be a hard target to your enemy. Use power weapons instead of default weapons, in casual games, you will spawn with an assault rifle and carbine, and in ranked games, you will spawn with a pistol and a carbine, now I will show you a tier list of weapons, so try to switch to upper tier weapons. Use melee, melee usually does 50 damage to any part of the body, some of the time it depends on your speed, damage doesn't go above 50. Always carry close range weapons like assault rifle, SMG, pistol because most of the time in FPS shooter games the guy who takes the first shot matters, if you carry a weapon that is not close range the switch time will get you When you enter a mode it will explain what to do in the game mode. Don't use BFP until an enemy closes to you, if you wait till your enemy you can get an easy kill, if you pull the BFP too early the players will try to keep the distance while shooting and it will be harder to kill enemies. As you can see there is a good amount of range from BFB and a normal range on melee, if the BFB spreads like this that means you can reach that range to kill the opponent. You can kill yourself through portals so be careful, and this game doesn't have friendly fire. You should always aim in and shoot the sniper because there is a small range that will hit your opponent and the no scopes don't catch that range. You can test every weapon in the practice mode so use it to your advantage. Now we can take a look at some portaling tips to improve your portaling speed. The only portal you can see through is your own portal, which is the same for your enemies and teammates. They only can see through their portals, but anyone can shoot through any portal. You can close enemy portals by using your grenades, but you can't close your teammates' portals. Your teammates' portals will be closed if they close them or if they die, and your grenades won't damage any. Always have a portal open so that you can open the other portal and get away from any situation and heal. Fight near portal walls, this will always be useful if you have the other portal open somewhere. Close your portal, if someone is chasing you, you don't need to close all two portals, if you close a portal the other one won't work, so when you portaling away from someone quickly close a portal so they can't follow you. Portal block, you can do this by opening your portals in the portal walls, so your enemies can't open portals in that portal walls, this tip will help you to modes like king of the hill or domination. You can aim in from your assault rifle or any scoped weapon and open a portal, in this way you can open a portal that is very far away from you easily. Portal blinks like this, if there's an enemy behind it so don't go into the portal straight away, shoot first, your crosshair will turn red if it catches an enemy. You will come out of the other portal with the same speed that you went into the first portal. Portal fake, you can bait your opponent with this trick, you only need to open a portal behind your opponent and they will try to kill you through the portal, so that way you can shoot your opponent from the back. Triple portal, this is a very hard trick to master, you need to open the two portals and you need to stand on the first portal, so that way you can see the view of the second portal, then you need to open the first portal again, then you only need to step back from the portal. In this way, you can go from point A to point B to
You can practice your portaling skills from the race mode. In this mode, you need to collect all the balls respectively. If you can't portal very well I recommend you to practice in this mode. So gamers that is it for this week's video, if you think these tips were worth your time please give this video a like, and if you want to see more videos like this make sure that you are subscribed, in the next video I will give you gamers a full guide in settings so, if you have any questions feel free to comment it in the comment section, so I will see you gamers in the next video until then.